Our general evaluator is an amazing Toastmaster who is a distinguished Toastmaster who's working on another distinguished Toastmaster award. She is a coach, a mentor to so many, and she has helped this club with consistency and intensity. And I would like to introduce our Toast, our general evaluator of the day, our club president, Roz Carter. Thank you, April. Wow. I'm so glad you selected that theme because it invited everyone to participate and really think about consistency. And in our speakers, Bond, when he talked about spin the wheel, he shared that his engagement in pathways is very important and encouraged others to consider that as well because he took an example of icebreaker. You might be in multiple paths in pathways and each path starts with an icebreaker, but it doesn't mean it's the same story because our life is evolving like a wheel, continually turning and changing us and improving us. So thank you, Bond. I will send you the evaluation form as promised. Tommy, Tommy and I grew up slightly over the last couple of years. I feel like we're school chums and we're learning from each other. She introduced a new social media platform to us and she used slides because I'm a visual learner to introduce this factor and how she incorporates it into her business. Her language was clear. So the visual aid was helpful. Her pace and her pauses allowed us to think about what she was saying and why she compared the social media platforms, specifically in the United States to how she made a decision for her business. Would you say that this has allowed you as an entrepreneur or soon to be entrepreneur, the information from both of our speakers have given you an idea, especially the social media piece of how to improve, engage and invite more people to your business. The comments from the audience is extremely helpful. And so when we invite you to either put comments in the chat or say it verbally within the time frame that we allow, it's giving us that opportunity to give the appropriate feedback that the speaker needs and something they can chew on so that they can improve their business. Please contact our two speakers whenever you can or put some more comments in the chat box about how you benefited from that. Table Topics Master Mona Lisa was exceptional. She invited people to explain their version of her question and she used entrepreneurship and consistency over intensity as her theme throughout asking questions for those who responded. And I know that Taya responded, Randy, Charles, and Ernie. We have people here who step up to the, the moment because the questions that Mona Lisa asked required you to give it some thought, but then express your answer, how you believe Mona's question posed to you. Overall, the meeting, yes, it started on time. It may not end on time because we have so much to say in our meetings. 
So if you need to leave, it's okay. But we want you to stick around because we always invite our guests to make comments of what they thought about the meeting. And we have some announcements. Rosabelle will talk about some new things we're looking at for future meeting agendas. And Vaughn will talk a little about the new self-pay program for members to renew their dues. Madam Toastmaster, you've done an excellent job with providing a great theme for us because we are dealing with consistency over intensity throughout our life, right? So thank you so much, April, for being an excellent Toastmaster of the day. Back to you. <laughs>